are out in an undisclosed location looking at a western diamondback. Very nice. We're in the big How did you find that? You got good eyes. Yeah, there he is. Western diamondback rattlesnake. He's got a cactus thing in his mouth. Like a cactus spine going up through its mouth. Yeah, we are way out beyond uh, the wiki up area. How old would you say that guy is? I'm counting his buttons. He's not very old. Now, you, how do you know that's not a Mojave? Because you can tell by the stripes on the tail. That's a Western Diamondback because you can tell all the stripes on the tail. Very slick. I'm gonna go that's a person who found it. <laughs> oh, you found it? No. Oh, Dave found it? <laughs> yeah. Dave's got good eyes. That's why we. It's not gonna bite me. I'm not gonna touch it. Doesn't like anybody. Here it is, the Western Diamondback, most venomous snake. No, I'm just kidding. It's my stupid Steve Irwin impersonation. It's one of the most. No, it isn't. It's got a pretty good strike range, so I don't want to be stupid here, but uh, yeah. I'm not going to. Uh, look at that. I'm leaving because I'm bored. You're bored. Very nice. Yeah, we are out here, um, out in the wiki up area here in Arizona. And uh, this poor little guy's got something stuck in his mouth. But I'm not about to help him. And I would say he's probably, I don't know, three years old maybe, two years. How old would you say the snake is, Dave? Uh, I would say it's about three years old. Yeah. That yeah, that's what I just that's what I just figured too. That's about sitting right. Still. Yeah, he's sitting right there. Look at that. Sweet. Just got here and the excitement is already starting. Yeah, he's got something in his mouth, the poor little It's like a is that a growth on his mouth or is that like something stuck to it? It's something stuck to it. He's got a he's got a big cactus spine. Like a cactus spine stuck in there? Oh well, he'll get that off. Oh, I'm not messing with him. <laughs> yeah, no. no but... Yeah, he'll figure it out. I got the patch nose for you, mister. You got what? Patch nose. Patch nose, nice. Western Diamondback. He's far enough from camp that we don't have to worry about him. Oh, I wouldn't worry about it anyways. Very nice. Now, how do you know that's not a Mojave? The tail, right? Well, the tail's one way, but yeah. Diamondback's got its pattern is composed of speckles. Uh huh. Like real fine little dots. Okay. A Mojave doesn't have that. A Mojave's pattern is. It's kind of like the difference between a, a Colombian boa and a true red tail. Okay. True red tails have a, have their patterns made of real fine velvet. You know, spots are so fine it makes it like velvet, like it's airbrushed. Uh huh. Whereas a Colombian boa, it's just straight pattern like solids yeah like our solid uh, color poor little guy he's like trying to get that out of his mouth actually he may have just dislodged it I think he did nice did he dislodge it's it healthy. its mouth is closed right now yeah I think he just I think he dislodged it I think yeah yeah thank you no this is great we just pulled in two minutes ago we just arrived here And we've got probably the best uh, snake hunter west of the Mississippi with us here, in Mr. Dave. And uh, he'll find anything if it's if it's around here. So beautiful Western Diamondback. I was trying to get a shot of his tail, but I don't really want to bother him. So we will leave this guy be, and uh, there'll definitely be more to come here. KG Constrictors on location here, field herping in uh, the desert southwest here of Arizona. Western Diamondback, beautiful, best left alone. All right, more to come. 
End of part one.